Good evening, everyone. The month of April could be big for three of our local hockey teams. The Keweenaw Storm, the 19 and under girls hockey team, along with the Minnesota Junior Hockey League champs, the Marquette Royals are both headed to nationals. And also in that bunch, the Marquette Sentinels, 16 and under girls hockey team. So today at the Barry Events Center, the hockey team played the NMU club team in hopes of raising funds for its upcoming trip to the USA Hockey Tier 2 Girls 16 and Under National Championships. Allison Carlson gets things started for the Sentinels rather early and because the team is down to just eight forwards, head coach Jeff Cornock says she plays with both lines to give them an extra boost and she did that today with a hat trick. So pretty good play from her. Later in the first period, Kaylee Godfrey with a shot and off the rebound, Lauren Fulker will score. That makes it 3 nothing Marquette. After the first period, the crowd honored the Marquette Royals and the, their league championship as Robbie Gervino brings out the Bush Cup. Back to the game, Soraya Utvut will get the save for the NMU club team. Later, Carlson feeds Ali Polich for the goal, and Marquette takes this game 6-2 over the NMU club team. And Cornock says the support his team gets from the community is tremendous. It was great. Um, you know, we sold a lot more tickets than uh, actually had, uh, you know, people show up. But, you know, that's probably the biggest crowd that uh, these girls have played in front of. It's, it's taken a long time to get here. Um, it's exciting for me uh, to have my daughter on the teams even better. You know, uh, what a great experience and memories that all these girls are going to have for a lifetime. Well, the team will leave Tuesday morning from Lakeview Arena for Nationals, which are April 2nd through 6th in Amherst, New York. The greatest of days for the state of Michigan. Shabazz Napier and UConn defeat Michigan State 60-54 to for the third berth to the Final Four. And the Spartan seniors become the first four-year players recruited by Tom Izzo to fail to make a Final Four. As for Michigan, Aaron Harrison's three-pointer with 2.3 seconds remaining sent them to the Final Four. As the Diaper Dandies escape 75-72 over Michigan. Nick Stauskas led all scorers with 24 points. So this is what the Final Four will look like in Arlington, Texas. Number one, Florida takes on UConn in the 6 o'clock game, followed by Kentucky and Wisconsin this Saturday. Sports scores and highlights, visit our website, UpperMichiganSource.com. All right, thank you so much, Lily. And kids enjoy the day on the slopes. That story is coming up.